Hello Earth Signs, Taurus, Capricorn, Virgo. Welcome my lovely Earth Angels to your reading. Today we're going to be looking at what your person wants you to do for them and their relationships. So this is someone that you're currently connected to and it's someone who's obviously wanting some changes or wanting some things to take place from your side. So we will look at that today and see what they are. But before I get started, please subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. And if you would like a private reading with me, please email me and I can send you over the booking details. Otherwise, let's have a look at signs. Let's have a look at this for you. What do they want you to do for them? Okay, there's a tough situation going on around here. What's going on? Three of Swords. Um, we've got the Empress and the King. And there's, there's the Sun that sits in the middle. Okay, could be an air sign that you're dealing with either way. Oh, look at my cards. Yeah, look, either way, what I'm getting is... There's someone here who... Three. Three's come up twice. It's an issue. There's someone here who's feeling like they are not a priority to you. Something or someone is in the picture and this person is aware about it. They're very intuitive. Could be a Pisces. Wouldn't be surprised. Pisces is super intuitive. They're like psychic, I swear. Um, but look, King of Cups is here. The judgment. They've got the, they're using their judgment and their intuition. There's someone here who... Yeah, they're feeling neglected. Eight of Swords, it's it's putting them in a bad place. Wow. This, they don't show it though. They're, they're coming up as the Empress. So they're showing like they've got all their stuff together. They're confident and, and, and cool and calm like a cucumber. Is that the saying? Um, but deep down, there's a lot of internal turmoil that you are not seeing Earth signs. Okay, they're feeling hurt and neglected. And it's this, it's this situation right here. It's a priority. There's, you've been making time for either another connection or work or hobbies or your friends. You've put priority on something else. And this person wants that to change. Not entirely. They just want to see some improvement. They're not expecting leaps and bounds. They're not expecting everything to change overnight. I feel like there's patience coming forward from this person. The Empress is telling me they're patient um, and they're willing to wait it out, which is good. There's a lot of compatibility here with you and them. But it might have been something recent that started with the Sun card as well, okay? Especially if it's like a recent connection or it's only like fairly recently that they've been feeling this way uh, about you. But either way, it's... It's coming up around them. Okay, what comes to mind is prove me wrong. Someone wants you to prove them wrong about something here, something about their what their parents think, what their culture dictates. It's like this person, they have a they have a pre uh, a precedent here, and I get prove me wrong. They want you to prove them wrong. What's going on here, Earth signs? I'm confused. Only a little bit because I feel like maybe they're confused and I'm picking up their energy. Now it's making me confused. <laughs> um, yeah, they're, they're struggling with this because a part of them knows you want them. But then another part is super confused and they don't want to feel that way anymore. Now, there's lots of children and family here, so this is someone who might want you to step up and get involved. So, like, meet their children. Maybe they want to meet your children. There's someone here who wants to blend families uh, or even potentially have a child with you. Okay, they want to start a family with you. They think it's time. You know, they think you're ready. They, they, they themselves are ready. So, lots of, like, things to do with family, children, and fertility. Or it's like they want you to have a better relationship with their children or you know 
look, I'm not going to lie. I feel like there could be this, this person might be separated from you. There might've been a divorce or like a, a parting of ways. And they, there might be someone here who's wanting you back. Um, they might be doing it very subtly. They still love you. King of Cups is here. They're unsure of telling it to you. They're unsure if you're dating anyone else or you're taken or you're interested. But they want you to miss what you had. They want you to miss that dynamic, being a family together, um, having a really functional relationship as you once all did. So they want you to make that little bit more effort for them and for their family and for their kids is, is what I'm getting here. Could also be, like I said, if you haven't had children with this person before, you might start to realize they're wanting these things um, and they're wanting them fairly soon. They're at that stage. Could also be like they want to adopt with you a pet, a child. This is this is like the creation stage of a relationship already when you, you create something together. Could even be business related. The judgment can be a contract. So there might be someone here who wants you to go into business with them, maybe invest your time, energy, money, resources into a venture, business venture with them. It's investment, whether it's into business, whether it's into the children, it's an investment into the relationship. And that's coming up fairly strongly. So I, yeah, they, they want this, this investment um, they want this investment to take place is, is what I'm getting. This could be a completely separate issue. They might have tried, you might have tried before and it didn't work, but this time around it's a little bit different. There is someone here who's waiting for you to open up and communicate. So if you've been in no contact with this person, they do want you to make contact um, and judge the situation differently is, is what I'm getting. So again, they're sort of watching and waiting and they're appearing one way, but on the inside, they're like a bit nervous going, oh, I hope they contact me. I hope they do this. Um, I hope they reach out. So, you know, maybe there's some news. I feel like they have some news they want to share with you, Earth Signs, but they're not going to be the first ones to do it. It's like they're waiting for you to be the first one. So it's, they're trying to feel their way through, um, this relationship and the connection that you have together so but they're being patient i'm getting that they're patient whilst this is all happening i'm going to wrap it up there so thank you again everyone for watching it does mean a lot um, i do have to be in touch very soon so thank you um, for all your support and hopefully we'll be in touch very soon so um, lots of love and angel blessings to you taurus cappy and virgo Thank you for all your support and we'll be in touch very soon. Bye for now.